friend from Nintendo, Matt Ryan, is here, and he has a new toy with him. This is the new 3DS XL. Tell us what is new about the new 3DS XL. Well, this new hardware is an improvement over the last versions. It's really exciting out there because it's got super stable 3D. It does face tracking so that no matter where you move your head, the 3D is still there. There's no flickering. It works really well. It has Amiibo NFC near field communication built in underneath the touch screen so you can just tap your Amiibo into it. There's some new buttons on there. Of course, the ZL and the ZR. Also, a C-Stick, which is really going to help you with some of those games, especially like a Resident Evil Revelations, where you could use the Circle Pad Pro. Well, now you don't need that anymore, and you can use the C-Stick. So there's some key games that are really going to show off some of these features. One of the big ones, obviously, is Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate, yeah. which there is a special edition new 3DS XL. Tell us about the partnership with Capcom and why that game was so important for this hardware. It's always important with Nintendo that we have great third-party support. The Monster Hunter franchise is a huge hit in Japan and sells really well on our system. So the game being on its fourth iteration here is going to be amazing. The game plays remarkably well on this new system. It looks great. And those partnerships really show off that we really do make games for everyone. Nintendo will have our Legend of Zeldas and our Marios and our Donkey Kongs, but bringing other great franchises like Monster Hunter to a system like this and letting it play the way it does and look the way it does and doing it in 3D is very important just to showcase that we've got a broad spectrum of experience. And that's something to make a distinction on too is that the machine is backwards compatible with the previous hardware that's been on there, meaning that the face tracking and the 3D on games that are already out there, Mario Kart 7, Luigi's Mansion, looks better. Makes these games actually look better as a 3D delivered piece of media, right? Yeah, exactly. This 3D and the face tracking and the, the stable 3D is totally going to go backwards because it's built into the hardware. So it makes those experiences even better. And if you're one of those players who's been constantly turning the 3D up and down or guilty, we urge everybody out there to try it. Try it without the 3D first and then flip it all the way up and see what the difference is. Yeah. And you're probably going to keep it on. One of the things that I think we're not talking about here is the performance boost as well within the machine. It's a more capable system. It's got a little more hardware punch to it, which means you're going to be able to load stuff quicker. But is that also going to see, you know, graphical improvements in some of the titles? Are we going to see the game start to look and play better too because of that? I think some games will really take advantage of a lot of the, the core internal parts of the system. Mm -hmm. So there's not a radical difference in the graphics, what we're going to see yet, mm -hmm. because the definition of the screen and all that kind of stuff hasn't changed. But the reality is, is that when your games load faster, or if you're surfing the internet and it just works faster, it makes the experience a little bit smoother and of course gets you into the game a lot quicker. So we'll have to see what happens down the road. How are existing 3DS players going to make this switch over? A lot of people have got their first launch edition 3DS or they bought in when the XL was, in, was launched. Some people are playing on the 2DS right now. Is it a case where you have to put the old machine away and you transfer everything from that machine to the new one? The reality is, is you can transfer over your content. There's a lot of easy ways to do it. I think for the person who's got to have it first, this can be a very popular product. Yeah. But if you want that Amiibo functionality and you want it built into your system, then this new Nintendo 3DS XL is the one you want. We did promise that we're going to bring a special Amiibo accessory that's going to allow you to bring Amiibo into portable hardware, and that's still coming. But if you want it built in, it's one less thing to carry around.